know that there are over 300,000 individuals every year that are born with sickle cell disease and that the vast majority of them are outside the United States. Sickle cell disease is killing hundreds of thousands of young children every year. And all these countries need to make resources available so that we can save these children and help them grow to become healthy, useful adults in their communities. Over half of babies born with sickle cell disease in low-income countries will die before the age of five. And SCD is the underlying cause of one in 12 newborn deaths in sub-Saharan Africa. But it's been shown that early identification and appropriate follow-up care dramatically reduces childhood mortality from SCD. That's why ASH is committed to working with partners in this region to develop and strengthen newborn screening and clinical networks for children with SCD. They have taken on probably one of the biggest humanitarian efforts for sickle cell disease, which is to establish newborn screening programs in Africa where their life expectancy in the first five years of life may be less than 70%. The Consortium on Newborn Screening in Africa is a collaboration between ASH African hematologists and public health authorities to demonstrate the effectiveness of newborn screening and early therapeutic interventions for babies with SCD. ASH works with stakeholders from seven countries to survey the existing SCD infrastructure and develop a shared protocol to guide screening practices and administration of early clinical interventions. The long-term goals are to build awareness around SCD, advocate for government ownership and expansion of programs, and promote access to low-cost early intervention therapies. If I hear people say sickle cell disease is a curse, is a death sentence, I get really sad. I have um, enough evidence to prove that children who are placed on treatment, they have lived better life as compared to children who never knew they have sickle cell disease. To drive progress in SCD management in low resource areas, ASH is providing subject matter expertise to global initiatives to help establish broad treatment guidelines, reduce costs of treatments such as hydroxyurea, promote further research in diagnostics and therapy, and educate healthcare providers. Another key partnership is the Sickle Cell Disease Coalition, which was founded by ASH in 2016 and has a growing membership of over 85 organizations from around the world. The Coalition has released a global resources library and a public service announcement on sickle cell disease in Africa as part of its effort to amplify the voice of the SCD stakeholder community and improve outcomes for individuals with SCD. It's an immeasurable impact on the community of individuals affected with this disease and we all look forward to the next decade of watching the dividends grow. 15 million babies will be born with SCD around the world over the next 30 years. ASH and other global stakeholders are helping to ensure they live the lives they deserve. But to sustain support on a local, national, and global level, we all must promote the need for comprehensive SCD care to address the global burden of the disease. If you'd like to support ASH's global SCD efforts, visit hematology.org donations to donate today.